the week of October 31st through November 4th, and I am Declan Doyle. Today is going to be fun, creepy, and a scary Halloween. What are you going to be for Halloween? Let's find out what our riddler will be for Halloween. Happy Halloween, Tristan! Thanks, Declan. Happy Halloween to you, too. Oh, and hello, Eagles! How are you? I'm still good. I hope you guys have a good Halloween. Anyways, did you get last week's riddle? If you don't remember it, it was the more you take, the more you leave behind. Ah. What were they? The answer was, drum roll please, footsteps! Oh. Are you ready for another riddle? All right then. When Jake was eight years old, his little brother Sean was half his age. Jack is now 20 years old. How old is Sean? Not too hard of a joke, hard of a riddle this time, but anyways, to the jokes. Who is the king of the pencil case? The ruler. Ha ha ha! That's a knee slapper. With that note, I go away. Footsteps? <laughs> I would have never known. Thanks, Tristan. Who has a birthday this week? If their birthday is today, they will have a spooky birthday. Let's say hello to Adora Coventry with the birthdays for this week. Thanks, Declan. Good morning. Happy Halloween. Today, I will be sharing this week's birthdays. Happy birthday. Harmony S. Alexander V. Micah M, Livia N, Serenity N, and Dylan L. And now for staff birthdays. Happy birthday to Mrs. Pagel. And that's all for this week. I hope to say yours one day. Back to you, Declan. Thanks, Adora. Happy birthday to all who had a birthday this week. Nice game, you of them. It was a rough weekend for MSU, but wait until next year. That being said, let's say hello to Charlie with this week in sports. Well, you already heard it was the winner for the US MSU game and U of M game. I hope your team won. Not much happening in Clarkson for sports, so we'll talk about the Detroit team. On November 2nd, the Detroit Pistons versus the Milwaukee Bucks at home. November 3rd, the Detroit Red Wings Red Wings will be versing the Washington Capitals at home. November 4th, the Detroit Pistons will be versing the Cleveland Cavaliers at home. November 5th, the Red Wings will be versing the New York Islanders at home. And on November 6th, the Detroit Lions will be versing the Green Bay Packers home. I would like to say, go Lions, but, well, I think y'all know. Back to Declan. Thanks, Charlie. Let's hope the Lions can do something. I hear that there's rain for tonight, trick-or-treating festivities. Let's hear from our very own meteorologist, the entertaining Nolan Zavagansky, with this week's magical weather. What do you think, Nolan? Will it rain tonight? There's nothing hidden in your head. The sorting hat can't see. So try me on, and I will tell you. According to my report, it is going to rain, yes. Hi, Eagles. This is Potter Nolan coming to you live from the AE SEL room. And here's your magical weather report. Today, Monday, October 31st, there will be a high of 57 and a low of 46. There is a 70% chance of rain. It is also Halloween today. On Tuesday, there will be a high of 59 and a low of 48, partly cloudy. On Wednesday, there will be a high of 63 and a low of 50. On Thursday, there will be a high of 63 and a low of 52, partly cloudy. And on Friday, there will be a high of 61 and a low of 48, partly cloudy. But all in all, great weather this week. Platform nine and three quarters awaits. The weather is great. Over to you, Declan. Thanks, Potter Nolan. I can't wait until next week's week to see what character you'll be next. I hope you like math month because 
The month of November is going to be a fun month for math. Now let's hear from our special correspondent, Madeline Herkowitz, about Math Month and the message of the week. Thanks, Declan. Happy Halloween, Eagles. This month will be Math Month. Like March is Reading Month, November is Math Month. Yay! Miss Townsend, along with Miss Hall, Miss Chen, and Miss Webner, have set up a math of wonderful math activities. To kick off the math month, Tuesday, watch the kickoff video. Wednesday will be numbers everywhere. Wear a shirt with a number on it. Thursday will be number art. Watch the video on number art and then turn your favorite number into art. Friday, play your favorite math game online. Over the weekend, go for a math walk. Look for the patterns. With all this math going on, seems like only fitting that this week's quote is about math. Math gives us a problem that has a solution. And remember, eagles, stay positive and never give up. Now on to you, Declan. Well, it looks like we are going to have a wet Halloween. However, the first time in three years, we will be having classroom Halloween parties, and a Halloween parade. Remember to be kind to our visitors. As we leave no October, we have exciting events happening in November. For example, November is Math Month, Veterans Day celebration, and of course, Thanksgiving. Remember, it goes keep soaring, and we will see you next week.